we got the bike. We got the river out in Washington. It's a gorgeous day. But I just thought I'd figure I'd talk about the Motaz Rowl. Rousey, Rouse, whatever you want to call it. We'll do like a midterm review um, so far. Well, first, first initial thoughts was I thought I hated it. Um, on the road, it's very noisy, very bumpy. It's pretty much like a paddle tire with these big gaps in between. So you can feel that when you're going down the pavement. Bup, 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 bup. So that I'm not really a fan of when it was brand new. But the more I've worn it in, the uh, better it's gotten. This has got about, I don't know, a thousand miles, 1500 miles on it, on a KLX. I usually have it about this much loaded too. That could be why it's wearing pretty good. But as far as off-road performance, that's where this tire really shines. Off-road, it's great in the mud, in the muck, in the sand, which, as you can see, we got quite a bit of that around here. It is Washington State. It does rain a lot. So, overall, it's been good. The front tire, nothing to write home about. It's the Metzler MC360. We got the mid-hard one, which is the totally wrong tire to have in this scenario. But honestly, it's not bad. Can't really complain about it. I do want to try more of the soft version, but as far as the Motaz Rouse on the KLX 300, I cannot complain. It does real good. The traction is great. It seems to hold up pretty well. It's a nice, thick, heavy compound. So it seems to really be holding up. Now, I did have the Dunlop D606 on here before. And honestly, I was a big fan of that tire. It's a great tire. It's cheap. Well, relatively cheap. And it lasted me like 2,500 miles. So, if I can get similar performance out of this one, we'll call it a win. So, either be it's either between the Motaz Rawls, Rawl Z, I don't know, however you say it. You Australians, you tell me how to say that. It's between the Motaz Rawls and the Dunlop D606. Anyways, appreciate you guys watching. This was a short little one by Northwest Moto. See you on the next one.